Management for life. The business of being you. Ever felt overwhelmed managing a shared mailbox at your workplace? You're not alone. We all know the struggle. Emails piling up, threads getting intertwined, and the constant fear of missing an important message. Shared mailboxes, while a fantastic tool for teamwork, can quickly turn into a labyrinth. Who is responsible for what? How do we keep track of all these emails? And let's not even start on the chaos that ensues when more than one person attempts to answer the same query. Then there's the issue of disorganization. Without a system, emails can easily get lost in the shuffle, leading to delayed responses and frustrated colleagues or clients. Communication, too, can often become inefficient, with team members sometimes left in the dark about who's doing what. But don't worry, there are strategies to tackle these challenges head-on. Stay tuned as we delve into the world of shared mailboxes and discover how to master them effectively. The first step is assigning clear roles and responsibilities. Now, this is vital because it helps prevent overlap and confusion. Let's consider an example. In a customer support team, you might have one staff member who's responsible for handling general inquiries. Another team member could be assigned to technical support, and a third one might handle all billing-related queries. By doing so, everyone knows what they are supposed to do and it reduces the chances of two people working on the same task. This approach not only improves efficiency, but also ensures that all types of queries are addressed by the right people. It's like having a well-rehearsed orchestra where each musician knows their part and plays it to perfection. Just imagine the harmony. So assign clear roles and responsibilities to your team members. Remember, a well-structured team is a productive team. Next, let's talk about the magic of folders and labels. In the world of shared mailboxes, these are your best friends, your lifeline, and your secret weapon all rolled into one. Imagine this. You open your shared mailbox, and instead of a cluttered mess of emails, you see neatly organized folders, each labeled with categories like inquiries, support tickets, and feedback. It's a sight for sore eyes, isn't it? So, how do you get there? Start by creating folders or labels for different types of emails. Once you've read or responded to an email, move it to the appropriate folder. This way, everyone can locate relevant messages in a jiffy. Plus, it eliminates the risk of important emails getting buried under a mountain of new ones. Remember, the goal is a clean, organized mailbox where every email has its place. With this system, no email will ever be lost in the chaos. Ever heard of a ticketing system? It's a game changer. Picture this, a flood of customer queries flowing in, each demanding attention. A ticketing system like Zendesk or Freshdesk can be your life raft. It's a tool designed to manage these incoming requests, converting each email into a ticket. Each ticket is unique, traceable, and manageable. Now think about your shared mailbox. With a ticketing system, you can assign each ticket to a specific staff member. No more confusion about who's handling what. It's all there, clear as day. And the best part, it prevents duplicate efforts. There's no need for two people to respond to the same query. You'll know who's doing what and when they're doing it. So how does this impact your workflow? Well, it ensures every inquiry is addressed promptly and efficiently. No more lost emails, no more missed opportunities. With this tool, every inquiry will be addressed promptly and efficiently. Communication is key, especially when it comes to shared mailboxes. It's essential to establish clear and concise communication protocols, a set of guidelines that streamline the process and make sure everyone is on the same page. Imagine this scenario. You're working in a team and you've got a shared mailbox bustling with emails. Without proper communication protocols, things can get messy real quick. But what if you had specific subject line prefixes to indicate the status or priority of an email, for instance, technical issue or, or sales inquiry? This way, everyone in the team instantly knows the nature and urgency of the email even before opening it. It's like having a signpost for every email, guiding it to the right person or action. Remember, establishing these protocols is not about complicating the process. It's about simplifying it. These protocols ensure every email is handled appropriately. Now, let's discuss the importance of scheduling dedicated time slots. In our fast-paced digital world, everyone is often trying to access the shared mailbox simultaneously. This can lead to confusion, overlapping responses, and even missed emails. So, how do we prevent this chaos? The answer is scheduling dedicated time slots. By allocating specific times throughout the day for staff members to check and respond to emails, we can avoid these conflicts. Think of it as a digital shift rotation. 
For instance, Jane could handle the mailbox in the morning, John takes over in the afternoon, and Jill wraps up the day. This not only ensures that all emails are attended to promptly, but it also allows for uninterrupted focus on the task at hand. Moreover, this approach reduces the likelihood of multiple responses to the same email and helps maintain a clean, organized, shared mailbox. Remember, timing is everything. Do you know that there's a way to automate a significant part of your email management? Indeed, this is possible with the efficient utilization of filters and rules, a smart strategy that can drastically lighten the burden on your team. Visualize your emails intelligently categorizing themselves and landing in the right place without manual intervention. Seems like magic, doesn't it? But it's not. This is simply a savvy utilization of technology. Setting up filters and rules in your email client equates to hiring a relentless virtual assistant. This aid can sort incoming messages based on various parameters, the sender's identity, the subject line, or specific keywords within the email. Depending on these factors, the email is then swiftly routed to the appropriate team member. For example, any email containing the word invoice could be directly transferred to your finance department. This automation simplifies your email triaging process, making it more streamlined, efficient, and less susceptible to human error. Moreover, once a team member responds to an email, it is essential that they move it from the inbox to a designated folder. This is a critical step in maintaining a clutter-free inbox and preventing staff members from becoming overwhelmed by an influx of mails. Another effective strategy is to assign only one staff member with a backup to the emails daily. This responsibility could rotate among the team on a daily or weekly basis, ensuring that the workload is evenly distributed and preventing any one individual from feeling overworked. Some staff members also find it useful to apply color codes to emails, responding to them based on their areas of expertise. Lastly, implementing a service level agreement, SLA, for staff to respond within a specific time frame, an hour or a best suited to your team's capacity, can significantly improve your group's productivity. So if you've been wading through a sea of emails manually, it's high time to switch gears. With the implementation of these strategies, every email will be efficiently handled and directed to the right person. Collaboration tools can make managing a shared mailbox a breeze, but how? Well, imagine integrating tools like Microsoft Teams or Slack with your shared mailbox. This integration facilitates real-time communication and collaboration among team members. Here's a scenario. You receive an email that requires a collective response. Rather than forwarding the email or copying everyone in a reply, you can simply start a thread in your collaboration tool of choice. This allows everyone to discuss the email, draft responses, and coordinate who will send the final reply. No more confusion or multiple responses to the same email. Additionally, these tools often come with features for tracking conversations and assigning tasks. This means you can assign an email to a specific team member, monitor the progress, and ensure that nothing slips through the cracks. With these tools, your team can collaborate seamlessly without cluttering the mailbox. Let's talk about the power of Standard Operating Procedures, or SOPs. They serve as your team's reference guide outlining the best practices for managing the shared mailbox. Think of them as your team's playbook, detailing how to categorize emails, escalate urgent issues, and collaborate effectively. For instance, your SOPs might include steps on how to handle a customer complaint that comes in via email or how to escalate a technical issue to the right team member. They provide a clear roadmap to guide your team's actions and decisions. They also ensure consistency in workflow so everyone is on the same page, reducing the risk of confusion or mistakes. This is especially important when you have multiple people managing a shared mailbox. It's like having a well-rehearsed orchestra where each musician knows exactly what to do and when to do it. With SOPs, consistency in workflow is guaranteed. Finally, never underestimate the power of training and support. It's one thing to have a shared mailbox in a whole different ball game to use it effectively. That's where training comes in. Offering training sessions or workshops can help familiarize staff members with the ins and outs of the shared mailbox software. It's about knowing which button to click, which folder to use, and how to use that tricky ticketing system. But the learning doesn't stop there. As with any tool or system, there will be questions, challenges, and perhaps even the occasional hiccup. That's why ongoing support is key. Having a support system ensures that these challenges are addressed promptly, keeping your mailbox management smooth and efficient. It's about building confidence, fostering understanding, 
and ultimately ensuring that your team can navigate the shared mailbox like the back of their hand. With proper training and support, your team will be well equipped to manage the shared mailbox effectively. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and send to a friend. Management for life, the business of being you.